Now this is the Mill Loch on uh, Upper Loch Urn in Fermanagh. And it looks very still and peaceful, but we're slightly concerned that it might be turning into Loch Ney. Remember last year, Loch Ney went bright green, a very timmy colour, but we don't want that to happen. So this is Jerry, my man. Hello, Jerry. You've got a bucket of water here, straight out of the loch. And what are you doing? Just having a wee check to see if there's any evidence of pollution. Mm -hmm. um, we got a complaint of the weekend. Look, that is an absolutely perfect colour. Yeah, There's nothing wrong nice with that. Nice and clean. Looks good. Okay. I'm would, just going to do a dissolved Would you drink it? Um, I've swam in it. Yeah. <laughs> and I know there are other regular swimmers here. Jerry, the man who can swim in a bucket of water. <laughs> <laughs> There we are. I dipped my toe in it anyway. But no, there's people regularly so in here. So um, it's How do you test it? I will do a couple of dissolved oxygen tests on it just to see. Sometimes if there's organic or nutrient enrichment, it can decrease the oxygen, dissolved oxygen levels of it. Can we have a go? Can I help you? We can have a wee look. I have a meter in the van. Yeah, good. Right, where's our kit? So, we have a wee DO meter. And we have a probe that goes in like so. Degrees fine for this time of year. Ten degrees temperature. Yeah, the Fucking dissolved oxygen would be cold, would Ninety-eight point nine, which is good and high for a good quality waterway. Yep. And eleven point eleven milligrams per liter. It's fine. I have no concerns about this particular sample at the minute. Looks lovely. Absolutely, utterly gorgeous. The sort of view I'm going to paint. 